Hi everyone, welcome back to Rocket Guys. In today's video, I'm going to go over some things that you can do to make some nice, juicy, tasty profit. Before we get started, if you're ever looking for some discounted Rocket League items and credits for much cheaper than the item shop, head over to RL Exchange. They offer the most reliable place to buy loads of different tradable items like Phoenix, White Dracos, and even Alpha Cat. They can deliver items to any platform and you can pay with loads of different payment methods. And with a 5 star Trustpilot rating, they are sure to have any items you could want. Check out RL Exchange from the link in the description and use code GUYS at checkout to get 3% off every purchase. First of all, the Golden Basket. This is simply free credits and we probably should have told you about these sooner than this because they are now out the game. But you all should have tried your best to get as many of them as possible. They give you an easy 500 to 600 credits depending on how much you sell them for, which can be a great starting point for your infantry. So next time the golden gifts are released, make sure you get as many of them as possible. If you are just getting into Rocket League, please subscribe and join our Discord server from the link in the description for tips to make you loads of profit. And we have frequent giveaways going on over there too. People are currently paying between 50 and 90 credits per gift and most are trying to sell for around 100 to 150. Now if you can get yourself a couple of these, you can sell them and make some credits easily. I would suggest buying for 80 and selling for around 120, but that is on PC and for PlayStation you might be able to get closer to 140. On Xbox I can't really find a common price that people are buying and selling them for, so if someone with some Xbox knowledge wants to leave a comment explaining this, then I will pin it for everyone to see. But anyway, the best part about the golden gifts is the fact that they are free and you should make the most of these by selling each one for pure credits. That is relying on you putting in the work to grind for those gifts. Like I said, you can flip them, but there are much better items to buy and sell, and I will tell you about one shortly. Before we carry on, I want to quickly announce that we'll be giving away a Fire God and a Dissolver to two different people once we hit 6,500 subscribers. So be sure to subscribe to be the first ones to know about any important market changes. The Unpainted Fennec is one of the best items to trade with early on. The best way to see how much to pay for them is to check what other people are paying because it's different at different times of day and on different platforms. On PC, a lot of people offer 20 under, but on Xbox it's often 100 under, so you are best off checking the prices yourself when you want to buy one. When selling them, you can get pure credits of course, but item offers can be the way forward as you can see from this trade here, which is actually one of the trades in our Nothing to Alpha Cap series. People who want the Fennec so they can use it in game don't mind overpaying in items a lot of the time, and you can get some good deals. And because a lot of traders are lazy, you will be one of the only people on the market accepting item offers, and you'll get all the cracked trades. The Titanium White Dominus is one item that holds its value very well, apart from the first time it was in the shop last year which was when it halved in price, if I remember correctly. But because it usually holds its value very well, this is a great item to flip for 1-2000 to 2, credits profit, like a lot of people are doing on PC where they pay a 1000 credits under minimum. Now onto the all important item that every big trader is keeping an eye on, the Rubber Ducky. For now, the duck is keeping its value well, with its price not floating about. You don't want to get tied down monitoring this and avoid peer pressure. Beach of us have all our favourite items to trade with, like the rubber ducky in this instance. However, I'm getting tired of these water jokes. What are you waiting for? I have no otter jokes. I'll just wet while you get past these shallow comments. I didn't want to say this. I've been forced into this. Help. Thank god that's over. Please, no one go investing in rubber ducks after that. If you didn't already guess, I was told to say this by thumbnail guy. Someone save me. Thank you for watching. If you enjoyed the video or found it helpful, please consider subscribing with notifications on. I'll wait here while you go do it. Don't be a beach. Go and like this video and subscribe for a bottle of water.